As California continues to battle this severe drought, high school students in Petaluma are making a difference to offset the negative impacts on our ecosystem. Looking out for our environment, of course, is part of building a better Bay Area. And ABC 7 News anchor Liz Kreutz was in Petaluma today with a look at how students are helping keep coho salmon alive in the midst of drought. Sixth period at Casa Grande High School in Petaluma likely looks a lot different than yours did. It certainly does for me. That's because these students are part of a one-of-a-kind fish hatchery program, learning firsthand about conservation. He is cleaning the side of the water line so to make sure grime doesn't build up. Right over here, they're doing weight counts right now. Typically, these students care for steelhead trout from the Russian River, but because of extreme drought conditions this year, they've been called upon to do something different. They've taken in thousands of coho salmon that are at risk of extinction. And suddenly, the summer after COVID, Mr. Hubacher said, oh, the drought is so bad that these other hatcheries need help. Science teacher Dan Hubacher explained that usually the coho salmon are cared for at the hatchery at Lake Sonoma, but water temperatures got so hot there this year that they needed to find the fish a new home. Making a long story short, ultimately we ended up with fish from Mendocino County, from the Russian River itself, and also Santa Cruz. This hatchery opened in 1993, and this is the first time in the program's history that the students have been approached and asked to care for coho salmon. They're like so endangered, and I think being a part of that is like a once in a lifetime opportunity. Because they need our help, they're extinct. Uh, they're part of the ecosystem. The hope is for the salmon to return sometime this fall to the hatchery at Lake Sonoma. Their time at Casa Grande High School, a short-term solution, but with a lot of impact. We are able to help, help out with the fish, and but it also allows um, long-term looking at these young adults being able to step in. It gives them hope for the future, too. And seeing that we can really make a difference, it's amazing. It's going to stay with us for the rest of our lives. In Petaluma, Liz Kreutz, ABC 7 News. Cool, right? What they're learning. Yeah.